have you seen benefit with um, irritable bowel syndrome or irritable bowel disease? Yes, yes, yes. Uh, Dr. Leonard Weinstock has done some amazing uh, research and case study on that. Uh, more specifically on Crohn's and ulcerative colitis, but you know, let's face it, irritable bowel syndrome and irritable bowel disease is just a precursor. Now, Crohn's and ulcerative colitis may have an autoimmune component to it, but you know, let it, it's pretty much six of one, half dozen of the other, just in earlier stages. I think you still need to identify what's actually going on in the gut. So there's different types of testing that can help with that, and identifying that is only going to add to the success, but. I think one of the common theories or the, the common thread that you're going to hear from all three of us is that low-dose naltrexone has such very little uh, risk to it that why not jump in? Because the beauty of it is that after a, a period of time, whatever that is defined for that individual, it can simply be stopped. Now the benefits of LDN will certainly stop. And so those symptoms may come roaring back, but, um, you know, it's like, why not? Why not? 